We bout to play 2K Brutal Sim, Step Back J Kobe got that clutch, throw it up That's game, I'm going through the lane Russell Westbrook, quickness Kyrie What up, what up? It's your boy You don't know Brutal Sim on the scene Wicked and mean with a next in real life basketball video for y'all man So I got a tournament coming up soon, right? So I said, you know what? I ain't really played in a minute. Last time I played, I uploaded the video, and y'all see how your boy be shooting lights out. So I'm working on my jump shot, cause you know your boy is a little slash between. I'm one of those sub archetypes that y'all want. I'm in between a shot creator and a sharpshooter, and got a little playmaking handles with it, man. So I'm I'm a little sub archetype, right? So I like to warm up right here in the mid range to tell the honest truth. Once I don't have someone to pass the ball, I always stay uh, within the three point line whenever I'm practicing and warming up and getting um, sharpening up on my shooting, right? So as you see, I'm shooting the ball and my follow through hand is following the ball. Wherever the ball goes, that's where my hand goes when I'm trying to work on my form at the moment, right? I always start off working on my form because my form is the most important thing I got. No matter who's coming at you on defense, once you're shooting that ball, your form must never change. And we are all victims of muscle memory, right? So it's very important that you practice your form, practice it at, a lot of people like intense shooting, I like relaxed shooting. I always practice shooting in a relaxed environment because whenever you're in those hectic environments, you want to be the most relaxed when you're shooting that ball. If someone's running at you, you still got to shoot like they're not there and you're just on this court by yourself. So then I'm going to go to a little jump shots, you know, put my a little bit more legs into it. And a lot of down for a lot of people get once they're shooting, they jump a little bit too high off the ground once they're shooting so i like to stay let's say about um not i must not jump to get off a jump shot six inches plus off the ground man you know why because when you're tired and your legs are out of the game you don't want to rely too much on your legs to get jump shots off all right so it's all about getting a little lift that will give you that energy to push that ball up and guide it straight to the rim, right? So as I said, I like relaxed shooting. Um, nothing must compromise your form. No matter what defender is coming at you, I'm 6'6", six, six, man. I don't know for all y'all, but I could get off pretty much any jump shot I want. No matter how close the defender is to me, I hit a bunch of contested shots. If I'm wide open, it's good as gold. And that's from me just practicing the form, remembering the form. So it becomes second nature after a while, man. And you don't worry, man. I got y'all some dunks in this. A bunch of people keep asking me, bro, can you dunk? I'm 6'6", six, six, man. I don't really got to jump that much, man. So I got some dunks somewhere in the middle coming soon. And I got a bunch of them at the end of this video, man. So got that coming up for y'all for sure, man. As you all see, I, I always, whenever I'm, you know, trying to build up, I'm, I'm sweating a little bit too much. I get in the free throw lines and work on my free throws, work on that follow through, work on that form. And it's all about working on your form. As I said, the problem with a lot of shooters, once they don't, one, they don't understand that it's all numbers, man. You don't have people that shooting in the three point line over 50% first thing first it's very rare you might get it for a little bit then everyone usually drops right back so it's okay to miss a few but you gotta remember get in a routine that gets you the most results for me it's this form for me is relax a relaxed jump of for the jump shot for me it's me being relaxed when I'm shooting and just not getting rattled okay people could come at your face and I'm still shooting that ball like if no one is there, right? So get yourself in that routine. Um, I do a little dribble, pull up, step back, you know, just to get myself in a few game situations, right? So this is my routine, man. I hope this video helped you all out. I hope you all enjoy this video. This is how your boy get to be shooting like a sharpshooter and shot creator out there, man, all right? Now I'm gonna just show y'all a few dunks. Start off a little basic. 
and I'm going to show myself a few hoops or whatever at the end of this video, man. To show y'all I got a little something still, man. I ain't got, you know, ain't as athletic as I used to be, you know, but I'm still dangerous, man. All right, at all corners of this game, man. And don't worry, I got some gameplay coming up soon for y'all, man. I had a game last night, which was very interesting, which is pretty much going to describe how a shooter thinks. Which is going to be the perfect video to describe my mindset once I'm playing the game, man. So, I hopefully, I hope you all enjoy this video, man. Alright, so it's your boy. It done no brutal sim on the scene, which you me. If you're first time to my channel, like the video, share the video, hit your boy, subscribe. If you're not your first time, like the video, share the video, you never know who's going to help. Your boy sim, one love, respect. Bless, man. Don't worry, the dunks are coming soon, man. <laughs> you don't know.